Hello, hello, today I'm going to show you an awesome unboxing video by me for you. Today let me introduce you the cordless hammer driver drill by Makita. Um, the serial number is DHP459 and, and there it is. Cordless hammer driver drill. Wow, this looks awesome. Really awesome because it's high quality product. Yeah, nice shape, nice weight. Oh, I will like it. I see this at the first second. Really nice thing. But where's the energy? Hmm, you will need a battery for this because not every cordless hammer drive drill is delivered with some of the batteries. You will need an 18 volt battery, but this is a universal battery for all Makita brushless engine um, um, battery cordless machines, really devices. So many devices you can use with this one um, thing of battery and it's nice and easy to use. So what's with the specific uh, specifications? Uh, you can go with the capacities in concrete uh, 13 millimeters, in steel 13 millimeters too, and wood 38 millimeters. Wow, wood screw 6 millimeters to 75 millimeters. And with a machine screw, you can go to up to M6. The no load speed is highly um, 0 to 1500, and low mode is um, 0 to 400. And the blows per minute are high, 0 to 22,500, and low is 0 to 6,000 of the blows per minute. This is a lot. The overall length is 192 millimeters. The voltage is 18, I, I told you. The battery cartridge is BL8050, BL8015 and BL1820 and BL8020B and so as a difference and more battery cartridges which I'm going to match with this machine. You have to look at the battery. There has to be a star on the bottom side. If, there's a, if, a, if there is a star on the bottom side, you are able to use it with this device. This is easy and nice. The noise of this sound pressure level is 82 decibel, sound power level is 93 decibel and this is yeah it's a little bit loud okay okay yeah. So what's next depending yeah switch action before inserting the battery cartridge into the tool always check to see that the switch trigger actually properly and returns to the off position when released and this is like battery I I told you before, yeah, and then you have to dip it. You only have to slide it into the rail on the back side, and you can see it is an 18 volt battery for this device. Now nothing is functioning because of no power, of course. You can see too. Here is an yellow plate on the bottom side. This is matches to your batteries with a star on top too because this is yellow then this little thing on the battery is yellow too so you can know it matches so what are lighting up the lamp do not lock in the light or see source of light directly pull the switch trigger to light up the lamp Oh yeah, the lamp keeps on lightning while the switch trigger is being pulled. The lamp goes out just after releasing the trigger. This is nice and handy. What is next? You can make a speed change. Always set the speed change lever fully to the correct position if you operate the tool with a speed change lever position halfway between the one side and two wide the tool may be damaged so you have two shift there um, between one and two and you can use it easily to change the speed first switch off the tool and then side speed change lever to two side or high speed tool number one that means it is a um, low speed modus with number two but there is more force behind that. If you're going to speed uh, level up one on top of the, uh, the device, you can, mm, you, you can do it faster, but not so much force. 
Uh, Justin's a fascinating talk. This is on the front side of your device. A fascinating talk can be adjusted 16 steps by turning the adjusting ring so that the graduations are eight with the arrows on the tool body. The fastening torque is minimum when the number one is aligned with the arrow and maximum when the number 16 is aligned with the arrow two. That means it's a harder torch and the other is the, is the lower torch. Before the active operation, drive a tri screw into your material for a piece of duplicate material to determine which torque level is required for a particularly appealing cast. So, and there are some other different um, things you can use for, for hammer, for drill, and for screws. And all these settings on the ring will get another torque indeed. So, in setting or removing the driver bit or the drill bit, this is in turn, turn the lever counterclockwise to open the chuck jaws. Plate the bit into the chuck as far as it will go. Turn the sleeve clockwise to tighten the chuck. To remove the bit, turn the sleeve counterclockwise. So that means you can do this by using the drill, or you can do this by using the hand, of course. And this is the hammer thing. There you can go to concrete, and mm, this is for the hard work. The other thing is for screws, and the other is for, for a, oh, I think, easy um, wood. Wood, you can drill into woods. This is nice and easy. So let's go installing something. There are some, you are able to rotate by your hand or you rotate by the machine, but always take care of your hands and fingers. Really nice. And it's easy to open, easy to install that little bits. And take care, there's a tremendous and sudden twisting force external on the tool and the bits at the time of hole breakthrough, when the hole becomes clogged with chips and particles, or when striking reinforced rods ambled in the concrete, for example. Here you can see how to get a bit or a drill inside of the machine, and then you can make a drilling operation. Pressing excessively on the tool will not speed up the drilling. In fact, this excessive pressure will only serve to damage the tip of your bit, decrease the tool performance and shorten the server life of the tool. There is a tremendous force exerted on the tool bit at the time of hole breakthrough. Hold the tool firmly and exact care when the bit begins to break through the workpiece. So let's have a test drill as you can see and that was easy to perform. Now this drilling in wood, when drilling in wood, the best results are obtained with wood drills equipment with a guide screw. The guide screw makes drilling easier to pulling the bit into the work piece. That is right, man. You have to use for concrete special drills. You have to use for metal special drills and for wood, of course, too. But this is only information. And there is a bit holder. And the bit holder is nice and easy to install, as you can see. Now and then we have to, to, um, to lock the bit holder and after this we are going to get another options for drilling not for drilling not for hammering only for the screws this is important to get and then you can use so many different bits with this one easy and going cordless hammer driver drill machine yeah that's nice and easy and it's light up and it's have drilling operation in concrete in wood in metal this is awesome and you can use bit hold for this and it is um, has a nice shape with your hand is a professional tool to use it all day long and you can remove and get a new battery inside if the machine is empty. Really nice and good product. I like it and I, I'm going to use it each day of, of working on with my hands, of course. 
so you can see this is a bit itself this bit matches too then go to torque level and you can see here i'm pushing the machine and the torque is there let's go let's do the torque a little bit more and we can see the um the power is going through my hand yeah or inside my hand hand ring here that is a torque machine or the torque area of this machine so i think that it is you can you have seen everything i am um, back to see what i i'm going to see you oh you can left and right uh rotation as you can see and that it is you have a light on on, on the front side nice light really nice and good bits good drills good machine good batteries really nice it's not so heavy it's medium heavy okay it's not a light wide it is for man so there's the battery now the uh, the, the machine is replaced with a uh, with a battery again you can see that is handled to be in five seconds jobs done easy going away Oh, so that it is. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe me and give me positive feedback. And I hope to see you again on my channel. And have fun with this Makita machine. I like it really much. So, battery out. Good job. <laughs> Look, this beauty device. Soon, soon. Oh, yeah.